the garden and then <sighs> you and your stupid rubber balls do you think they're that important please listen to me <laughs> hmm. emmy when i was searching for the ball in the garden i found an important clue okay huh uh. <clears throat> you see huh oh. is this the yes this is my drawing emmy really didn't someone steal it yesterday where did you find it Laying on the ground, but look at it. Mm. That mark was definitely on the spaceship. Aha! Uh -huh. Was it really? Wait a sec, I'm absolutely sure that you didn't have that in your drawing. Me too! I didn't even remember anything like that symbol yesterday. So that means somebody must have added it to my drawing. Huh? Who would do something like that? Dunno. But I guess it must have been the shadow beings who did it. Huh? The shadow beings? You know, that's a good name for them. I know. But I don't understand this. Do you mean that first they took your drawing away and then they added that symbol to it and finally brought the picture back so that you could find it in the garden by accident? Yup. I know it doesn't make any sense at all, but that's what happened. But why would they do that, Rocky? Does this mean that shadow beings are good guys who are helping us or bad guys? <sighs> I'm confused by the whole thing, Emmy. If the shadow beings want to help us out, why don't they go and save Princess Lizzie all by themselves? But if they're actually the bad guys instead, why would they help us by drawing that bony symbol on this picture and give it back? Maybe they can't save her. Maybe they don't have enough strength themselves to help her. Huh? Wait, what do you mean by that, Emmy? I mean, maybe shadow beings are too weak. Maybe they can only move a small piece of paper around. After all, they're only shadows, you know. Huh. That sounds rational, I suppose. Shadows with no bodies can't have any real strength. Stealing that piece of paper and bringing it back must have been all they could do to help us, Rocky. <sighs> There's still another question that needs answering, though. What question? Look at that. Who drew this symbol here? If the shadow beings are really so weak and powerless themselves, they wouldn't be able to use pens, right? But somebody drew those bones. Um, well, maybe... Wait, I've got it, Rocky. They've got a leader who's more powerful than they are. That's a great idea. I wonder who it could be. I've got no idea. I'm just guessing here, you know. Oh. We've got to go and ask a shadow being about this. Otherwise, we'll be stuck forever. Just guessing doesn't really help us out. <sighs> but they're mysterious and scary creatures. We can barely see them. It won't be easy to catch one of them. Hey, I know. What do you think about bringing this drawing to your father and the police chief now, Emmy? Now that we have this bone symbol as well, they would know what kind of spaceship they would be looking for, right? No, that's no use. Oh. <sighs> it would be extremely difficult to tell my father about the shadow beings. I know the police dogs would laugh at us. And they'd say we drew the symbol ourselves. Plus, Daddy wouldn't believe in shadow beings either. Fine. If we can't do this and we can't do that, what can we do to help Princess Lizzie? Ugh. 
Forget it. I'm going home now to play Thunderpaws. See ya. Wait! Hmm? <gasps> Let's go to the Space Harbor. Fine by me. But why? Well, as you know, all the spaceships that come to our planet park there. Maybe the ship that snatched Lizzie the other day is actually parked there right now. I don't believe that. It's been two days, so it must have flown away a long time ago. No! Lizzie absolutely loves these fancy chocolate dog biscuits. She just has to eat lots of them every day. Huh? So what? You can't find that kind of chocolate biscuit anywhere else in the universe except here on Dibby Dog's planet. Oh, I get it. The villains have to park their ship at the Space Harbor first, then go to the city and buy some chocolate dog biscuits for Lizzie. Finally. Oh, Gummy Bones, I didn't know you were so smart, Emmy. You're a genius. <laughs> what do you mean? Did you think I was just a bimbo? Well, you do kind of look like an airhead. <laughs> hey! oh! Oh! Emmy, please don't be mad anymore. <sighs> this is the candy shop. Okay, great, let's go. Welcome, children. Afternoon. Do you have any chocolate dog biscuits left today? Oh, we've got a big selection, dear. The finest, sweetest delicacies. For example, big lollipops, gooey gumdrops. We've also got dog-shaped cookies, too. No, oh, thanks. We only want chocolate dog biscuits. You have them? Oh, sorry. Unfortunately, we've temporarily run out of them. Just a little while ago, a man came in and bought all we had, a 20-kilogram box. He insisted on taking them all. Oh! Huh? I suppose he must like our chocolate dog biscuits a whole lot. What did the guy look like? Can you describe him to us? Um... Spit it out! Don't just stare like that! Why are you so interested in him, little girl? Uh, huh. Uh. Huh? Uh, 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 <laughs> it's so lovely. Your perfume smells really terrific, you know. <laughs> a very nice scent. Uh -huh. It really is a pleasure to smell. Oh, really? But I'm not even wearing perfume today, young man. Uh, uh, well, obviously you smell good even without it. Wait, are you maybe the legendary perfume princess from the fairy tales? Uh huh? Do I smell that good? <laughs> so, may I ask you, oh, beautiful perfume princess, did the buyer of the chocolate dog biscuits have black stripes, you know, like a zebra? No. He was a very handsome gentleman. Oh. Very good looking and well behaved, too. And what's more, he wore a really well made black hat. It was so dashing on him. Oh, like a huh? bowler hat? <laughs> Thank you. Bye, lady. Oh, and I truly believe that you could be in a great TV commercial for Vanish Perfume. I mean that. Goodbye, then. Oh, Vanish? Oh, wait a second. Isn't Vanish bug spray? Let's go over there and check it out. Oh, look. A 
Isn't that Emmy and Rocky there? Huh. The nerve of them bounding around like that, just the two of them. What will people think? Oh, Missy. Do you maybe have a crush on Rocky? No, I don't. I'm totally in love. Oh. <laughs>